just spread it to form a circle that will be this 360 okay so this is how my spread is going to look like so by the time i return it back okay it forms that um, effect for us so i'll just come in i'll just come in with my pattern pepper now this is my pattern pepper And I'm going to draw out my starting slash line. This is the starting line for my slash and spread. So I'll pick up this. I'm going to apply my adhesive at the tip of each one of them. As you can see right here so once that is done I come in right here at the midpoint and I spread okay so I'm going to spread as much as I can for you to have that effect you need to spread as much as you can forming a circle with this you can see me forming the circle so I'll just bring this and allow it to touch this if possible okay so that is how we are going to slash okay so i don't actually have much pepper to demonstrate this so if you have pepper or you can even do it on your fabric just lay your fabric you are working with and slash okay so let me just okay so i think we are good to go like this so on this part i'll just do this on this part i'll just do this okay so this is the high load part so simply i'll come in like this and i'll start to join the tips I'll start to join the tips. So this is it. So I'll just join them to form a circle. I'll just join them to form a circle. Okay. So I'll also add up more pepper to here to complete this exercise. Okay, so I just want to leave it. It's also forming a circle. So you can just add up more pepper below. So I believe you understand what I'm, I'm doing right here. Okay, so this is actually how you are going to go about this particular screen. Okay, so I join my paper and this is what I have when my paper is joined. I just go ahead and apply my adhesive where necessary. Okay, so that has been done. So the next is to continue um, connecting my lines okay so i'll just connect my line remember it's high load 
So I'll just keep connecting. I'll keep connecting. I'll keep connecting till I get to that point. Okay. So note the part at which you are going to join your sleeve. So I'll just cut now. I'm going to cut now. I'm pretending this is the circle so here i'm going to cut in through here this is going to be this is the side of the sleeve if you remember before we slashed so we are going to add our seam allowances and join back at this side so i will just go in okay so just take the a rounded shape Can you see? So that is that. So by the time you can see this part is already flaying up. You can see it's already flaying up. And the longer piece is longer. So by the time you go in with this and cut on tape on a fabric and cutting on the right fabric with it, which is the scuba fabric. So this is what we are going to get. Okay, so the flay flays out, flays out. You can see it flaying out. The part that is high low will be large. The part um, that is high will be high. Can you see? So this part that will be on the side will now form that longer loop. Okay? So people, that is how to go about this beautiful sleeve and I believe you learned a lot from this tutorial. So if you are new to this channel, please kindly subscribe. Turn on your notification bell to receive videos like this every day. Like this video, share to family and friends and drop your comment on the comment section and your suggestions as well. So thank you for coming once again and see you in the next one. Bye!